Everybody, Clash of Lords here, and as you guys can see from the cover of it, this is the new update, and it's going to be the review that I'll be doing, giving my rating, and stuff like that. So it's the beginning, what you guys see in the, basically, is the top right corner, you guys, well, actually on the top, you guys will see the treaty info. The treaty info is basically, it says, it says a few, you gotta buy it, so basically, I don't know about every day you get it, but I doubt every day you get it, but I'll have more information about that uh, later on, but... You guys, the benefit one you guys will get is basically getting the, if you clear 10, 10 raids, you guys get a coral easter egg. Especially before the coral, before it wasn't called coral easter, before it was just called easter. So I don't know if they're going to keep doing that for each of the holidays or how that's going to work out. I don't honestly know. But free, uh, what is it, uh, 50 uh, free building cooldown, so an hour and 50 uses left so basically it takes down take take gee, well, it's like this if you have like a, something that's like 20 hours left to use it it'll take an hour and 50 minutes off it that's how it is and you're basically free gold store free like gold production you can use that and earn that uh, two extra treasure chest from the 100 battles that's actually a good thing and if you guys want to get the uh, you know buy the hero one because you need to have the hero one purchase to get that and as you guys can see the hero arena is right over here this is a heroes arena and apparently these are the heroes of the day i don't know if it's going to be all about i don't know if this is going to be like your f favorite hero that's going to be in the front page or not so i don't know about that as you guys can see this is basically crazy i, I i've i haven't won that many games of this for some reason so let's give it a go as you guys can see this is basically how it is um versus him Versus uh, Rhea, I don't know how to say his name, I'm sorry. I'm basically a peasant right now, so I don't have that much stuff going on. Alright, we got rid of one of his heroes. And apparently now we haven't... The, apparently they're all fighting and none of these guys can actually get another hero down. Just get another hero down, honestly. What is this? Alright, he's got two heroes. He's got three heroes left. I got three, four heroes left. I'm going to lose all my heroes in less than 10 seconds because it always happens to me. Uh, what are they even fighting? Can you tell me that? What are they fighting? As you can see, none of the health is going down. So what are they fighting? What is my heroes fighting? That's all I want to know. What are they fighting? They're they're just in a basically giant pile and they're not they're not even doing anything. You saw you see that? They're in a giant pile and they're not even doing anything. Screw that's just basically stupid. So I'm it's basically sad. Honestly, I've only got one once. And I've lost every other time for some stupid reason. Is that reason you guys can see from right there? So annoying, honestly. And as you guys can see from the next from the update, we've gotten. Uh, they said they changed the the what is it called? The victory statue's movement. So I'll show you guys what 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 I mean by the movement. All right, you know, let me just you know four times this and uh, speed this up and show you guys. Alright, right over here, as you guys can see, the little circle thing that's coming around it, that's basically what they changed. So basically, if the hero has that, that's that's like new for it. So when you use it, the heroes will, uh, you know, have a giant circle around it, showing you how much it's taking out on it. So that's pretty sick. That's about it for that. And they changed the graphics on this. So yeah, that's actually about it. And, and uh, for that victory statue part... Nothing else has changed for the quality of it. And as you guys can see, if you guys can go to hero part, before this says recruit, now this says hero. So basically, you just have to hero and you use heroes. And that's basically how it works now. It's called hero now. And like I said, the special is not, it's not called Easter egg anymore. It's called coral. I don't know why it's called coral. So please don't ask. The new hero is called plunder. And it basically does, uh, he's an aggressive hero, does uh, 693 damage. And that's pretty uh, big, 693 damage. Same with, well, Demon Slayer is still the highest with 1,000. I'm I'm hoping to get him soon. I have around 3,500. I'll get him soon. And if you guys uh, are checking this out, let's see this. It's worth 5,500. It's worth more than the Demon Slayer. So it depends. I'm going to see how the Demon Slayer works out when I get it. And I'll do a review on it for you guys if it's actually good or if it's actually bad, really bad. I They should have... To put a little more stuff in that Demon Slayer, honestly. But by far, this uh, new uh, update is actually good, except for the Heroes Arena part. It's honestly, they have to fix the how the ranking systems goes on that. That is actually crazy. 
I don't even know how anybody's even winning this. Uh, well, you, you know the only way these guys are winning this is basically they have some high, high troops. And apparently these guys, apparently Niggy is losing to... Niggy and Assassin are losing to some guy named... <laughs> how are these, how is this guy winning? He's got 12. How many wins does he have? 18. How is that even possible? Niggy has won. 18. He's won. 12 and he's lost five and he is apparently first so i don't i don't know how this writing system is basically going so basically i have to change a lot of stuff honestly but that's about it for this update i believe i've covered everything so yeah i hope you guys do enjoy this video and our guild is at 21,000. so if you guys want to check us out you guys can check us out make sure you hit the subscribe button like for all updates on Clash of Lords 2 and hopefully I'll have some more news on some cool events and some other cool stuff going on. So I'll talk to you guys all later. Have a great day. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button for more Clash of Lords 2 content. Peace out.